Basketball in China. In basketball, China is recognized as the strongest nation in Asia, and earned the eighth place in the world in the last two Olympics. China's level of play is improving swiftly, and some believe the nation will be one of the top four teams in the world in about ten years. In the 2011 Asia Championship, the Chinese national team captured the crown and booked a place at the London Olympics. China has traditionally been the number one basketball power in Asia, winning the Asia Championship 15 out of 19 times. Outside of Asia, the Chinese national team has struggled against top-flight teams. However, in recent years, China has shown they can beat top European teams. In the Athens Olympic Games, China advanced to the final eight. After a 67 to 66 win over defending world champion Serbia and Montenegro, at the 2006 World Championship, China also earned two victories against Senegal and Slovenia, two basketball powers. On the road to the London Olympics, the Chinese national team dominated the 2011 Asia Championship and captured the crown in the final, securing a spot at the London Games. Brian Gorgian, a renowned Australian basketball coach who has worked closely with the Chinese players, believes that China's level of play is improving swiftly. In the last five years, I've seen a huge change in the development of Chinese players," said Gorgian. "The Chinese are getting experience from outside and taking it seriously. Some even think China will be one of the top four teams in the world in about ten years." They are a good team, and they'll continue to get better," said head coach of the U.S. Olympic team. They have too many resources and the passion to become better. In the 2008 Beijing Olympic Games, China's basketball team had an outstanding performance. China was in the group of death, with the United States, Spain, and Greece. It showed grit and made it to the quarterfinals. China nearly beat Spain, the defending Olympic champion. The game went into overtime, with Spain prevailing 85 to 75 in the end. The legendary Yao Ming fouled out after scoring only 11 points. He was four for 12 from the field and had four turnovers. In his confrontation with the All-Star U.S. team, with Kobe Bryant, Dwayne Wade, and LeBron James in the lineup, Team China looked spectacular, leading the scoreboard in the first 20 minutes. At six minutes in the second quarter, the score was 29 to 29. But after that. China got blown out behind double digits and lost it. The game was billed as one of the mark events of the Olympics and one of the most important sporting events in Chinese history. Presented by Jian Yuli.